obviously, you know, I'm talking to you now, talking of friends. I can't not ask you um, when the news broke on Saturday what your reaction was, really. Um, to be honest, it's everyone's devastated. Um, she literally was the mother hen of Love Island, and I just feel like this hopefully has shocked people to be nicer people, especially with regards to online and social media, because it has to stop, it has to come to an end. And She's such an amazing person, but she's been in the industry for so long, and she's lived through her life. She's made mistakes, as humans do, publicly, and I think she hasn't deserved anything that she's had to deal with with the press and trolls and things like that. And I just think I'm, I'm absolutely devastated for her family, for her close friends, and I just I hope people can learn from this. I mean, it is a complete tragedy. Mm. When something like this happens to the entertainment industry, what do you think that it really shines a light on? I honestly think it's 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 the public who follow these people who think who hide behind a keyboard and kind of say comments because it's their opinion, which is fair enough. People are entitled to an opinion, but don't share it on that person's page. Like if you don't like someone, if you don't like what they're wearing, if you don't like how they look, keep it to yourself. Put it on your WhatsApp group. You know, it doesn't need to be said directly to that person. Um, and I think that's so important because you know it it ruins people's lives. It really does. What was she like, Montana? I mean, you know, these people have ideas of perhaps what she was like. You know. What yeah. What was she like? I wasn't very, very close with her. Like, obviously, I met her through Love Island. She was always there to help with guidance. And obviously, it's it's really hard for contestants to come on that show and then come off and kind of be shocked by, you know, how big the show was. And she's always just been there um, as a helping hand. She's always there for advice. She's always so positive and bubbly and smiley. And, yeah, I'm devastated I'm not going to be able to see her again, to be honest. Oh, wow. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm stuck in the school at home, <laughs> No! <laughs>